I feel like shit. I'm grateful for the people trying to keep me positive, though. I am. Did you go for a piece of pizza? No. No, you don't want any pizza? No. no. But I am grateful to the nice ones. Mm -hmm. But the mean, annoying, antagonizing ones, I can't stand. Just the same stupid questions over and over and over and over and over again. You know, they did that to Jesus when they were like, prophesy, prophesy, right? And he was just silent with all these stupid questions being thrown at him. Mm -hmm. Hi, Chibi. Hi, Willie. Hmm. Like, I don't get it. I don't get it. Maybe someday I'll get it, but I don't get it. I don't understand. Sabella, no one gives a fuck about Gary. Stop being a troublemaker. You claim you're a Christian, but here you are running into trouble whenever you can. God hates that, by the way. Like, grow the fuck up, child. Like, how old are you? Are you in your 40s and you're still acting like this? Smoke some more, it cures cancer. All right, I will. Well, Shanny, if it doesn't affect you, don't let it bother you. Well, why keep repeating the same stupid thing over and over again? I'm not abusive. No. You're going to ban me for speaking facts? No. You're just being annoying. God punishes the wicked. You're the only one whose life has imploded multiple times. Uh, Job? Job? Hello? Jesus? Joseph? Hell, Abraham and Lot? The Bible tells you, you will have tribulation. You don't know what you're talking about, girl next door. Yeah. You are abusive. No, I'm not. You're abusive and you're gaslighting. Now I will block you. Damn it. Fucking gotta go to my fucking phone. Ugh, go away, weirdo. Do you honestly think you are Job or Jesus? No, but I face tribulation like them. Mm -hmm. 
G-Man, me and my black Hebrew Israelites will get you. That's a threat. So, this is what you haters are, you know, enabling a psychotic man who threatens women daily. Okay. Have fun with that. Hi, Roxy. What's up, Jacqueline? Bye, Savella. I really don't care to know you anymore. Just leave me alone. Yes, K1, he is. I'm trying to help you out, but you only... That's not true, Package. That's not true, coffee, coffee artist. Stop lying. They are better than us. No, you're just antagonizing. I don't like you either, and I don't care to know you either. You've been facing a lot of tribulations lately. Yeah, that's because we're under the Great Tribulation. They, they just want to fight tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to block everyone who wants a stupid fight. I don't have the energy. Demonically, very strong tonight. Chibi says, Rev, don't give up. You might fail a few times. I know it's shattering, but trust me, you'll get there. Oh, thank you. Thanks. I don't see your comment package, and I'm not going to scroll back to, like, far up. You know how many people talk? Quite a few people. <laughs> yeah, I believe he's gonna he's gonna do it. He just he just needs to I believe really, in himself. I really want to get a call center job. I think exactly, be... Jacqueline. Fighting it is no good, so exhausting. Yeah, I can't do it anymore. I'm too old for that shit. Thank you, Nick. All you want is attention. But let you wait, wait, wait. You say all you want is attention. You should have plenty of energy considering you don't do anything. You put a comment. Isn't it that you want attention? You put the comment in. I, I know I'm just going to get attention. You know, one thing that's good about me. No, no good thing happened, she. They found something. I gotta go back. I have not harmed every life I've touched. Oh. Jesus Christ. See, that type of language is literally like out of abuse playbooks. Right? You get what I mean? People that really want to just abuse you say stuff like that. It's transparent. So, uh, Stephanie Rosnicki said you would never survive one day of fibro. Probably not. Me? Yeah. No, not you. This is Hannah B. Girl. Oh, sorry. I got him. Oh, what a boy. I hope I can buy the cancer cell. You're <laughs> fucked in the head. Wow, what? And they call us crazy, man. Right? I never dreamed of saying something like that. I mean, they revel in in abuse death. And, and death and harming people and replaying exploited tragedies over and over and over again. Yep. 
It's like, guys, you really need to find something else to do with your life. They revel, they revel in reliving trauma. Yep. That's hell, I think. Yeah, yeah, Barbie girl, people do suck. Like, really bad. I just got a call today on the on the phone on our shitty phone number uh, of verbal abuse. Uh, hey, I just picked up. I the, know, right? It was total verbal abuse. Right. And I'm just sitting here going, "Thank you." You know, why don't you talk to me like a human being? I said, "You're talking to me like a troll." He said, "That's because I am an internet troll." I said, "Oh." <laughs> Talk to me like a human being. Loser, loser. Did you prophesy you'd be a loser? Yeah, exactly. And then I'm like, well, did I, did you prophesy? <laughs> and then he's like, oh, 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 He had fun. So I said, you have a nice day. Cripes. What do you think you have I think it's a cute. <clears throat> what a boy. Rev, that's how I would talk to you. It's called being honest. No, it's called being an asshole. <laughs> yeah. So I guess you're an asshole. You're an asshole. Yeah. If you're okay with talking to somebody like that, you're just an asshole. Yeah. Exactly. And you're like a t second grader. That's, that's what second graders do to kids. Like they did to Tommy in Halloween. The boogeyman's gonna get you. The boogeyman's gonna get you. It's the same no, thing. No, the cats are fine, Package. The cats are fine. Cats. I, I've said this several times. I was just talking about it. I know. Jesus Christ. He's right here. <laughs> I don't Cats. like your demanding attitude. Man, they are Better crazy. an asshole than lazy beggars. Okay, well, you can go in silence. And you too, because you're just creepy. I don't like people who are demanding. Is it a full moon or something? Thank you, Jacqueline. Aw, oh, man, I hope you have unlimited talk. What a waste of time and money. <laughs> <sighs> Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh. Uh. That's what my mom says when she's doing night shifts at the hospital. Is it a full moon? I know, right? Well, it's true. It's true. And and you ask anybody that's in the, the business of hospitals, it's, things go up at those times. Wow, look at all that false outrage. Probably by the same person. Hi, hamburger with cheese. I feel bad for Amber. She's, yeah. She feels so defeated, but it's like, it is a year. You can do it. I believe in Amber. I think she can stop binging for a whole year. God bless her. I know. It's so sad. I think she can. Have I managed to calm down? I don't know. Hi, Inky Blots. I'm a teacher. My class is way crazier on a full moon. I know, right? Jesus.
Uh, dementia ward. Ah, uh, bless your heart. I love the dementia ward, though. I love working with people with dementia. They are the best people, I swear. What's the sound? That's my computer. Yeah. The fan. I need to look into it. I haven't, though. I just unplug it and blow it out. Feel bad Rev hasn't had a break in caring for you, Shani. Do you have any friends to help you so poor Rev can have a break? No, oh, I'm fine, dude. I, huh. I'm just here and I, I take care of what my baby needs and in the best way I can. I'm fine. I'm all right. Yeah. I'd be lying if I didn't start a little bit hungry. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> Foods. Foods. I would totally go for like a a, a Whopper meal or a big chicken sandwich meal. Big Burger King. Oh, their big chicken sandwich. I love that. The original chicken sandwich. That's like my favorite. Mmm. I know. I do got a good guy, don't I? I, I want to... No. I got to be better. But the thing is, I want to be better. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. I want to. <laughs> Therapy. People can be really cool, though. They really can. It's like, why Why would you call up somebody like that and just call them a loser like that? Like, I would never dream of doing that to someone I... Even I hated. I would never do that. Like, it's... Weird to me. God, they can't fucking get over themselves and their hate. Oh, God. I'm sorry, my love. No, it's not your fault. You can't contain your disgust. That's how I feel. That's why I don't want to ever do this. I don't know what kind of demon pit our live streams go to. It's like a wormhole to a demon pit of AI bots of just hate. Oh <laughs> like, what the God? It's hell. It's like, don't these people ever consider being happy instead of making everyone miserable around them? No, I don't think so. Oh my God. Mama Cheetos asking where she can send you a burger. God bless you. I would uh, a shout out to Carolina Rose. Who's that? Mama Cheeto, do you want me do you want do you have Instagram? You could message Shani on Instagram and I could give you an address. Has Rev done anything to celebrate Black History Month? Do you celebrate Black History Month? I'm trying to think. I, 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 no, I've never done anything to actively observe it. Maybe I should. Jesus Christ. J-Dubs, don't talk bad about my husband because I wouldn't fuck you. No, he's right, Shannon. Don't defend me on that. I was fucked up in the head at the time, but I don't care. It happened. So don't, you don't have to defend me on that. That's Just what... Stop it, okay? He's trying to move on and get help for everything. Yeah, that's true. Oh my god.
Send me something? I don't want to send you anything, dude. Ugh, God. Ugh, all stalkers can please see the door. All stalkers can go see the fucking door. I don't care. shouldn't stick up for Chantel. You know what, people? I, I, You know what? You shouldn't be bullying Chantel. How about that? Not really, Chi Lover. Chantel ain't perfect, no. But, but, but when she's clearly being uh, stalked which it is, people that care about her should say something. Like, this ain't right. You know? It's not that you agree with her on everything. Of course not. Leave her alone. Fuck. Gossipers do not inherit the kingdom of God. Stop it. No. For the love of Christ, stop it. Jelly pasta. That's a sin. Yeah, I agree with that, Chibi. I'm seeing what you're saying, Johnny Apple, Fapple Seed. God, please don't argue with me or just try to find fault in me. I'm not trying to ignore anyone. Someone made a vid that Salah and his pals are a I don't care. People lie on the internet. Lie. I'm not going to freak out over it. If Chantel isn't worried, I'm not going to be worried. Because it's none of my business and it's not my life. Does Rev have a dream job? Uh, yeah, to be a radio broadcaster. Yeah, I, that's number one. Definitely. Radio. Uh, but I would actually love to be like a caretaker of a place, like, like, um, like if I could have a gig where it's like a hotel or something, I could stay at the hotel and have food or whatever and take care of the place. That, I'd love that. That's a pretty cool job. She appreciates the nice comments. Chat goes fast sometimes. Sorry, Johnny, your messages are very sweet. Yeah. Oh, no worries at all. I haven't been the only one. By no means, place and fault will blame. It's positivity here. More so, ignore the hate. Fuck them. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Would you consider moving for the right job? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. 
and we're not tied down really it's not too much well yeah they'll relocate them yeah yeah no i'm fine i'm here thank you though hi nashi how are you I used to have a house sitting business years ago. It was fun to travel around being paid to sleep and just make sure no one robs the place. Uh, house sitting's fun. Yeah. I mean, that's what it, if you were going house hopping and doing it as a job, all over, that's what it would be house sitting. A house sitting, yeah. A house sitting job. Yeah. But saying caretaker is like, you know, that's more of a fancy way of saying it, I guess. Yeah. A caretaker. Like that. Rev could make a radio show on YouTube right now. Yeah. Like a billion other times, and then they get banned. Would you ban him if he did make a radio show? It's not going to be on YouTube. No? It would not be on YouTube, no. I don't have a radio, but maybe a podcast since they're popular. Yeah. Yeah, that's a possibility, but not right now. It's just not... You gotta get in a stable place. Yeah. And, and then, yeah, I, I would love to do that again. I'd love it. I, I believe in you. Thank you. You don't believe in yourself, though. It's not that. It's that I have barriers with mental shit that I'm really trying to overcome. I really am. Yeah, you should probably go through therapy a little bit. Yeah, exactly. Coping. Yeah. I, I need more coping mechanisms, I think. And I think job placement might be a good thing to go into. You know? With the county. Yeah. Job placement. Because whatever they say you can go to, I'm going to be able to go to there won't be any legal issue or nothing. True. So that's probably a good idea. I miss Jason reading the Bible. That's what the last Nashi said. Oh, I, I love when he you. reads the Bible. Thank you, Nashi. <laughs> that's flattery. Thank you. On the couch with Dr. Tammy. Hey, Rev and Shani, I have a small YT channel that does interviews sometimes, allows others to get their story out there without being attacked. Cool. Let me go to your channel. Oh, wow. All right. So... I'm not a doctor, but I play one on YouTube. Oh, okay. <laughs> it sounds interesting. Cool. Yeah, hit me up on um, Instagram. Shani needs love. I listen and donate to Red Reeve and read in the Bible on a podcast. That's what Point and Laugh says. Rose's last channel, he had over 1K subs. Why did you delete it? Just wondering. Because uh, Shannon and I had made a decision to get off social media completely. Uh, this is a thing that she really needs. So 
it's in our life. But I, yeah, I, I just cut the, I just cut its throat because I wanted to, really. I want to be off everything. Every, yeah. Everything. A Christian current world events podcast would be perfect for Jason. Yeah, it would. I know, but I, you can do it again. You love doing that. Yeah, I need a place to have a place to do these things. Okay, I get it. He wants his own office. Yes. Yes, I do. No, they didn't weigh me at the mammogram place. Jesus Christ. Can people mind their own business? Like, Lord Jesus, can you please help people mind their own business instead of digging into people's, you know, personal business and then demanding them to answer you? Well, that's what I'm The saying. same question over and over again, which you already answered. Yeah. We don't have to rehash it. Will you ever do a panel friendly, of course? Yeah, I would if they're friendly. He wants to leave. You you want to leave me, honey? Okay. <laughs> You're welcome, Celeste. Jason and Shani are about to fight again. We are? Okay. I didn't know that. I didn't either. <laughs> Get offline if you don't want people digging. Why do I have to get online? Because people are nosy. All right. I'll contact you after the stream, Tammy. <laughs> Did Jesus bring you cigarettes? Jeez. <laughs> Jesus and cigarettes. I do not allow anyone to attack my panel guests. Oh, I like that. It just comes to a point where it's like, God, can you just stop with this dumb shit? Yeah. Like, people really need to learn how to communicate with others and tr try to stop triggering them. Yeah. They miss your wrestling show. <laughs> we have like two episodes. Because you tell all your business? No, I don't. Do you know when the last time I took a shit, Tom Jones? Bet you don't. Because I didn't say it. Nah, it's okay, Nashy. Awesome, Tammy. Hi, Petty Patty. I have interviewed Cyrex and Marshall Mathers the fourth. Ah, cool. Back when wrestling was good, yeah. Before they freaking hired Logan Paul. He, they're gonna hire Jake. Jake's like, I'm sick of taking punches to the face. Nah. Well, if they took the correct career, I gotta fucking pee. One minute from the start. Oh God, Jesus. Bless! Ah! Woo! Ow! I'm okay. Holy crap, man. Ow! Uh. Uh. Well, on the wrestling issue, uh, you know, I think if Logan and Jake Paul took the correct career path, they would have been a tag team in the WWE, and they would have been like the top tag team. But that's neither here nor there, I guess. Yeah, Logan Paul. I guess a lot of people don't like him. He said he's like an. He said he was a narcissist or something. <laughs> Because I said crazy. 
I'll start a podcast when I got a place to do it. I I had a channel with 21,000 subs. I, I don't really, it doesn't matter to me subs or anything. Oh, give a shit. Ow, ow, ow. Oh. Mr. Gavin, the caps. Jason, we know that you told G Man that you wanted to leave Shanny. Yep. That's not true at all. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I could tell you the truth of what was said <coughs> if you want to know what was truly said to him at one time I could tell you that uh, but seeing as that that guy wants to do nothing but twist shit from the time that we spoke I don't think I want to talk about anything that happened with him because he's just a liar he, he, he sensationalizes everything to, to get people clicking on his stuff. And, and that's really what it was about. That's why he helped us in the first place, which is so weird. That, that you, would take, you would take money and, and, and uh, time and, and the place that you own just to get into the person's lives so that you can create content. Um, that's really weird. Mm-hmm. It's extremely strange behavior. Yeah, and I'm done with it. Yeah. The games these people play and everything, I just... Ugh. I could just be with Gavin. Uh, yeah, I'm fine with you and yeah. Gavin and Watermelon and the boys. Yeah. And, 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 and just that. That's that's the dream life. Yeah. Just enjoying my family. Yeah, Gavin loves his family. That's all I care about, is just enjoying my family and loving my family. Yeah. I feel like shit right now, though. God, why does that take so much out of me? Well, because you're expending more more calories every step because of your pain. We learned that. Yeah. That's why. <sighs> it's exhausting. Yes. I think I'm gonna go, guys. I love you. You have a good day. A good night. I'm gonna take my last gabapentin for today and I'm just gonna watch a movie and then probably just sleep. Alright, good night folks. Night.